Good evening. We begin tonight with the latest from the census reports released by this month by the Ottawa police. The police chief is responding after the findings reveal a troubling divide. The force attempts to diversify its ranks. CTV's Christina Succi is back from the Police Services Board meeting and joins us now with more. Christina? Matt, as the force continues in its effort to grow a more diverse team, frustration too is growing among some members of Ottawa Police, an overwhelming majority of whom are white, who say diversity is taking precedence over merit and is costing them jobs. Why is an officer like this not promoted? And we believe it's uh, because race is a factor. It was just last week a hearing got underway for an Ottawa police officer alleging he was passed over for a promotion because of his skin color. It comes as a census report released by the Ottawa police found six out of seven Ottawa officers are white and more than 60 percent men. Top three objectives uh, over the next uh, business plan is to focus on diversity and inclusion and ensuring that our promotions and transfers policy uh, are fair, they're transparent. We will ensure... A clear call for change, according to Police Chief Charles Bordalo, and yet there has been pushback. Non-minority staff saying efforts to diversify the force is interfering with merit-based promotions. In the report section of open-ended comments, one respondent writes, employees recognize and embrace diversity. However, the attitude of forcing diversity on us by changing transfer and promotion policy is highly counterproductive. Another saying, OPS has created a terrible environment for people that want to give it their all but don't fit into the accommodated spectrum. It is absolutely shameful. Because from leadership, you can actually see changes in policies. But advocates so right for now, racialized groups say short. that Very just isn't true. Right Reverse discrimination is a, an invention. It doesn't exist in the reality of the world we live in, and notably in Ottawa. It is very dangerous if we do not address it. Katia Peters of the Ottawa Police Community Equity, Equity Council admits there has been some growing pains. We're trying to remove the barriers uh, in order to give access to other individuals or groups that are in the past historically were always um, you know, excluded. We want to make sure our members are well taken care of. Head of the Police Board, Councillor Eli El Shantiri says times have changed and adjustments must be made. If we don't acknowledge it, if we don't understand it, how we're going to move forward. El Shantiri says Chief Bordelow was also assigned a direction tonight, which means all results from reports like this one will be tied into the performance and evaluation of the police chief as well as the deputy chiefs. Matt. Okay, CTV's Christina Succi reporting live for us tonight.